Hello everyone and welcome to Wednesday. Uh, this evening we went over to my parents' house and had some dinner. My mom made some uh, crab cake sandwiches, which is really good. And while we were over there, we also picked up this. What is this? Well, this is just one of uh, actually many things that we are storing in our freezer for my parents because my parents are actually uh, getting new appliances. They've been using the same appliances since they um, moved there, which I think 22 years? Something like that. It was over 20. I think, I think 22 years. They've had the same refrigerator for 22 years. They've had the same microwave for 22 years. They've had the same oven for 22 years. And tomorrow that is changing. So they've had to move all the stuff out of their freezer. And um, I was like, you know, we can take some of it and keep it frozen until you get things you know switched over and they were like that's a good idea so we've taken some of it and um you know tomorrow we'll actually be we'll be over there to help facilitate that there's delivery guys coming but we're going to be over there and help them a little bit and uh they're going to have new appliances and that's that's really cool they're going to be stainless steel yeah which uh you know i was going to say has been the look for a bit but it has for a long time actually but my parents you know, appliances are 22 years old, so I guess they've probably went through the ebb and flow of several different looks for a while. But um, I'm, look I'm looking forward to that. They've, uh, you know, they are definitely the people, and I probably get this from them, that, like, if it's not broken, we don't need another one. Um, that's the way it was growing up, and I've really kept a lot of that same mindset, you know, myself which is probably one of the reasons that would explain why we still have the 2004 Ford Escape. It's like, it's technically functional. Um, so uh, they're finally getting new stuff tomorrow and I'm looking forward to it and we'll, we'll help them. But that's why we had to get you know, some, of their, uh, some of their groceries, but they'll get those back. I don't wanna keep their, you know, their soup from them or whatever. Um, the other thing is that yesterday I recorded a lot of Mario Today on the agenda is mail. So right now we haven't done mail. Upstairs is not barren. I mean, it's always kind of messy because that's where I work. But um, we're going to take all the mail up there and get started and do uh, October, November. I think those are the months yeah. that we need to do. Do you have a cappy? He was rolling. Were you rolling? Oh, no. Oh, good boy. Cappy, I have another one. Good boy. <laughs> I love you. A little bit later and it's done. And I'm not even going to take you into that room because it it mm, it looks like it exploded. <laughs> like doing doing two mail videos is already going to be a lot, but um you know, they were I mean, honestly, like October was October was a a, a bigger than average mail month and then November was huge. And one of the things that the cats received is a little pickle and they love it and they, they really love it they really love it and they both love it which means that whoever gets to it first gets to play with it but right now it's Sagan's and he's very happy to have his his, li <laughs> his little pickle you flipping it up yourself he says you if this? he says if no one throws it for me I'll go get it myself gracious cat did you just do a forward roll off the bottom of the stairs? That's Tayo. You got to be okay. There he goes again. One of the one of the interesting things about the cats is that you know they say cats always land on their their feet, which is relatively true. Um, I've noticed since you know they've never been in a house with stairs. Seeing them adjust to this has been really interesting. Um, they've adjusted pretty well. Did you see him lift his head? <laughs> <laughs> but occasionally they do things like that. The good news is because they have claws and the, the stairs are carpeted, when they do things like that, they don't just fall the way down because they'll just like grip the stairs. But yeah, this is actually kind of uh, preposterous. He's just literally like rolling down the stairs. And he's just so excited. He's just so happy. And I'm glad that, um, I'm glad that he's received some joy. So... Anytime, you know, people send us stuff, we're always very grateful. And, like, the cats can't, like, say anything, but clearly, like, they love the crap out of the stuff that you guys send, so they appreciate it, too. 
You done? Nope, time to go again. Okay, all right. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and end it here. Um, thank you so much for watching. With, uh, with the two mail videos being completed, that's actually really great. Uh, that puts us really on schedule for uh, completing the, uh, a lot of the stuff for December in time for, um, for Stephen Plays. And then also with the mail done, having things ready, ready for Stephen Vlog so whenever we continue to push forward, there won't be any sort of, uh, you know, things that we have to wait on, and that's exciting. So I'll get these to uh, Dan tomorrow because we have to always give them to him on a physical drive. Um, doing the two mail videos was probably like 800 gigs of footage, so i uh, got to hand that over physically. It's faster than sending it over Dropbox. And uh, we'll get it back from Dan soon enough, and soon you guys will be seeing it. So that's exciting. Hi, hey, bud. You like the pickle. He likes the pickle. He's yeah. wondering where it is. Where's the pickle? Where is it? You have to be careful with you and the pickle. You're willing to go to great lengths to get that pickle, sir. Aren't you? <laughs> anyway, thank you so much for watching. And as always, let's be back tomorrow, shall we?